My leader is wrapped with flexible woven metal to prevent anything toothy from biting through it. But that's not stopping whatever's down here. Right, this is, this is, this is wire I've got here. That's actually gone through that. Gone right through it. Ah! And it doesn't happen oh, just no. once. Again, look at that. I've done it again. Ah! Don't believe it. That's three times. This is 50 pound braided wire. And it's just cut through it. It was on for a fraction of a second. The wire has been bitten through like it's cotton thread. If I fell in the water here, I could have chunks bitten out of me in seconds. Just as I think something is going to bite through my line again, I finally get a good hookup. That feels like it's attached properly. All right, let's see. And as I pull my catch in, I see the horrifying full effect of what's down there. Right, right. This is very interesting. Catfish. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. One fish slashed in half by another in a lightning fast attack. In the time that it took to bring that in, well, half of it's been taken. This has actually been bitten on the head as well, um, where, where there's bone, where it's harder tissue. I can see the signature here. I can see the semicircular bite marks, and you can actually even see the individual tooth marks here. So this is you know, a large fish, and it's just come in, and it's just been repeatedly biting. This went from being a perfectly healthy fish to being half devoured in a matter of seconds. It's just one thing that needs to happen, and it becomes a victim. Like Oscar, one minute happily swimming, dead the next. What could be responsible? Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like the River Monsters page.